Gdish. This is Project Green Knight. My motto from HBO is here. We are under a tremendous amount of pressure just to get things done as fast as we can. And back to one, back to one. And now that Len is watching over our shoulders, you know, it just kind of adds to that. Jason is doing a very good job as a director. He has a clear vision. But if he is not able to make his days, then we're going to have to discuss what it would mean to shoot the rest of the film digitally. Effie and Jason, they don't necessarily get along so much, but that's to be expected on a set of an HBO caliber quality movie. And cut. Okay, let's move on. Hey, God. Today on the set of Project Greenlight, Lynn Amato is coming to set. So there's an added pressure that we do well, and today is a good day on the set. The character of Lynn wasn't established enough. Sometimes it felt like the character of Lynn was just thrown in there to raise the stakes and make it appear as though the, the filmmakers within the production were under duress. Now I feel like Glenn is looking over my shoulder, which I don't like. It's just very frustrating to feel as if your work is being diminished by Glenn Amato, who decided to come and uh, criticize something that he hasn't really been a part of from the beginning. I often wondered if the character of Glenn was too compelling, and the filmmakers of the show put themselves in a corner by not being able to generate enough material for Lynn to do. It seems as though audiences might be uh, hungry for more Lynn. Lynn's notes are very good, but I have some notes for his notes. Then he had notes for my notes, which I didn't appreciate because I wanted to give the notes. He's not in a position to be giving notes from the story to the person who's watching the story. So my notes, uh, which are better notes, are being ignored. And I think the audience 100% of the time agrees with me. And this conflict is now becoming a huge distraction from the making of the leisure class. If the disagreement doesn't come to a resolution at some point soon, the production runs the risk of running off schedule and off budget. The stunt that they're doing tonight is a very good stunt, and I like the stunt. But if you don't do a safe stunt, then you did the bad stunt. He's complaining about how he's complaining about how they're more concerned with the stunt, but if he doesn't get the stunt, then the stunt will have to be done in post.